Hi, I'm Matt. It's amazing to me to see how God can take our weaknesses and our strengths and, and do greater things in us. A weakness of mine is organizing and planning, but a strength is service. But I'm able to be present. Even though I can't plan at times, I'm present and able to serve when there's needs that pop up around me. I'm Brian, and I've always been told I'm loud. But God created me that way, and now I use it to tell people about Him. Hi, I'm Robin, and God created me with some worrying, but I've used that to turn it around to be compassionate for other people. Hi, I'm Christy, and I've always been told I'm a little bit on the bossy side, but I prefer to call that leadership skills. And in fact, that is how God created me, to be a leader, to take charge of things when it needs to be. Last month, we looked at Ephesians 2.10, which says that we are all God's masterpiece, created to do good works for Jesus. You might have been told your whole life that you are something negative, that you're not created the right way, that you don't look the right way, you don't act the right way. But listen, God makes no mistakes. There are no accidents with God. He created you on purpose for a specific purpose. And so the way that you are can always be used for Jesus. And so we want to know from you, what are some of the things that you've always been told that you are too, or things that you are not enough? Let us know in the comments. We'd love to hear from you so we can all kind of celebrate. Hey, the world may see that I have been created one way that's negative, but God uses it in immeasurable ways now.